Hello everyone, welcome to Tutorials Point. In this video, we are going to talk about the second important system of the plants after the root system is known as the shoot system. This is include the stem. So let us introduce ourselves to the stem. So stem, this is the main axis of the shoot system, right? Now what is the shoot system? Shoot system is the stem with its leaves and other structures like the flowers, fruits, which is bearing in the stem is known as the shoot system. So shoot system includes everything above the soil like the stem, the flowers, the leaves, the fruits, etc. So this includes the shoot system. This is the ascending part of the shoot axis, so which comes up. So it is the ascending part of the axis. This is very importantly positively phototrophic, which means that they like light and it moves towards light. And from the as compared to the roots, which are positively geotrophic, that means they move towards the earth or uh, soil, but the stem, they are negatively geotrophic. They come out of the soil and move against the soil. So they are negatively geotrophic and positively phototrophic. They develop from the plumule of the embryo. So what happens? The roots we know they develop from the radical, but from a germinating seed, the plumule this develops into the shoot system or the stem. This is differentiated into nodes and internodes. So these are the structures which are present in the uh, stem system and these nodes and internodes, they alternate each other throughout the length of the stem. Now let us discuss about the important functions played by the stem. The stem, the primary function of the stem is the conduction of water, minerals and the food materials. So the water and mineral that has been absorbed by the roots has to be conducted to the leaves where which is the kitchen of the plants. So there the food will be uh, synthesized or made. So this water and minerals this is being conducted by the from the roots to the leaves by the stem. Again the food which is being made in the leaves that is to be conducted to different parts of the plants and different cells of the plants that is also achieved by the stem. So stem helps in the conduction process. Now the second important function is the production and the support of the leaves and various other structures like the reproductive structures. So in this video we have introduced ourselves to a structure or to a part of the plant which is the stem. I hope you have understood and liked this video. Thank you.